All right, what's up guys? RK here, the non-hippie farmer, and I wanted to show you an update of our new uh, back porch system. So we actually moved the system that was on our back porch before and we put it in the front. And so this is what's happening in our back now. So I actually got these two uh, zip grow tower. Each tower would be equivalent of having basically like a three by five foot grow bed. It's just uh, vertical instead of horizontal. And the zip grow towers are a lot lighter. They're much more uh, portable, transportable. And so I just uh, planted a bunch of uh, little seedlings that I got from the store in there. And you'll see here that I'm actually pumping from this the uh, the floating raft grow bed. Just the the end of it over here is actually uh, would be like a sump. And the fish tank was a little bit higher than than the um, the floating raft bed, so I just just drained basically doing that solids lift overflow from the fish tank right into the trough but I was getting a lot of uh, solids and a lot of people said it doesn't matter but I didn't like it and I wanted to create some sort of like a seed growing system and so I took an old one of the old Home Depot um, you know concrete tubs that we're using as grow beds and I put it into the bed with some Hydrogen, and so that's going to basically work as a way to pre-cycle grow media for when we're helping people and it's actually working as a solids filter and if you see here I'm actually using it to to grow to grow my seed so I just put in a different media that I'm testing and throw the seeds in there with just the bottom in in, in the uh, in the water and it looks like it's sprouting seeds and so I'll keep you updated on how those go, but these are the other things. Just put these these uh, floating rafts in the bed and got a bunch of plants and stuck them in there. So for the, in the actual pots, I'm trying a new mixture of doing 50% coconut core and 50% vermiculite. I've heard that's good and so I wanted to test it out. And so we'll have the mix of vermiculite and coconut core, and then we'll also have the just a straight hydrogen and black cinder. So I will let you guys know how it goes, and um, we'll keep you updated. All right, till then. 